Hey everyone, I'm Cameron, and today I'm looking at describing images on the web for blind people using artificial intelligence and machine learning models from Google's Gemini Pro Vision API. Uh, one of the considerations with alt text, which is what we're doing today, is that context is everything. This means that when you describe an image in a page, you need to consider the content surrounding that image because it might change how you describe uh, the graphic. WebM.org talks about this at length. You should check it out. But suffice to say, if I want a description of this cat on petco.com, I should consider the surrounding content. So what I'll do is I'll put this section of petco.com, which is called Deals by Pet Type, into Maker Suite, ask it for a description of the portion of the page, and gives me a description. The screenshot shows a portion of petco.com, features circular icons with the different pet type on it. Uh, it then enumerates the icon names and mild hallucination on the last one. It says there's a paw print, there's no paw print. And then the text below the icon corresponds to the type of pet shown in the icon. Great. Okay, we'll take it. So with the exception of that paw print hallucination, this is pretty good. Now, our original objective was to describe the cat image. So given this context for the page section on petco.com, describe this image, its purpose in the page. And I'm going to go back to petco.com. Going to grab this image of the cat. And I hope to see something like this is an image of an orange cat. Uh, it's part of the deals by pet type section. And you can click on it and do something. So, what did I get? This is circular icon features a close up picture of an orange tabby cat wearing a blue collar with a tag on it. The cat is looking up and to the right of the camera. The icon is on a blue dark blue background with a green border. It's part of a row of similar icons, each featuring a different type of pet. The purpose of this icon and others like it is to allow users to quickly and easily navigate to the section of the website that features products and information relevant to that specific type of pet. When a user clicks on the cat icon, they'll be taken to the cat section of the website where they can find everything from cat food and toys to cat beds and litter. That is about as good as I was hoping for. There's some overreaching uh, mild hallucination on this last part that indicates that there's no way the model would know what is available on the jump from that link. But otherwise, it's doing what I had hoped. It describes this image not just in terms of its standalone content, but in terms of its context on the page. Next steps here would be to try to prompt engineer this to be more succinct uh, and more um, specific to the act actual intention of the, the image in like a tighter description. But I'm pretty happy with this.